Aloha, welcome to Patty Pucka Pouring Art. I'm in Kona pouring and I'm pouring on photo paper. Um, I'm going to be using the same colors as I did on my last video. Um, my last video I did a Dutch pour on paper. Today I'm going to be using the same colors except I took out the bone black and I added the iron oxide. And I'm going to be doing a center swipe using um, U.S. Floetrol and Australian Floetrol mixed with Amsterdam Black Oxide as my swipe color. My base color is going to be white. I'm not sure what brand white this is. This is from leftover from last year. But um, I'm using the same consistency. These are all thin paints. Uh, it seems like the Floetrol is super thin here, even more so than it is in California. I don't know why. But um, anyway, let's go over the colors real quick. This is a golden turquoise with a PBO blue-green. Really pretty iridescent color. This is Golden's Transparent Iron Oxide. This is Deco Art Extreme Sheen Sapphire. Not sure, this is a, some kind of lime green craft paint. This I mixed Handy Art Red with yellow. And this is a Hagee Life Purple Haze Pigment and the, what is it, the Purple Flash Folk Art Color Shift together. Sort of peacock colors again. Um, if you want to see how I pour on paper, you can go ahead and check out my other video with how I made the platform and what colors I use. So I'm going to be right back. This I need to tape down. This came off. I need to make sure I have a little piece of tape in the middle so it doesn't move. So I'll be right back with you and we'll get the canvas base on. And the paper base on. Okay, let's get this white base on. Go ahead and just pour it on there. This paint seems like I can't get it thin enough. I'm going to go ahead and help it out. I'm doing a swipe so it doesn't have to be perfect on here. I'm going to be swiping right through it. I'm going to be using damp paper towels as my swipe. I use this too, and they're cheap for colors. And they're hands on paint samples. No paint samples are to get in the colors. They're nice too. I think I can get the towels and I'll on and just swipe it easy. I think that's enough. Now, this is about half. It's half by half. I actually. Photo paper or regular copy paper size. So if you have an 8 by 10 frame, be easy to cut this down. If your edges do curl or just a little bit, you can just make a nice clean cut around that. Okay, let's see what we can do here. I think I want the iron oxide. Do I want that to be, yeah, let's do it. I'm trying to guess at the middle here. Who knows? Doesn't have to be perfect. Okay, and then I think I want the blue. Whoops. Ooh. Dark blue. I'm just gonna go right on top of that. Purple.
the regular orange edge. I love orange and the green. I hope, hope I don't regret this green. I didn't on the last on the. I used it on a Dutch pour and I loved it. So you never know. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead and put that black right down the middle. It usually sinks. Try to put it right over that iron oxide. All right. Let's get to swiping. used this uh, paper towel before so this is going to be new for me using this type of paper towel Yeah, I'm already not fond of this kind of paper towel because it has the little, you can see the little holes in it. I usually use one that doesn't, it's not like that. But that's all I have for now, so let's go with it. And it's flimsier than my other one. I always hold my breath when I'm swiping. You have to do it really slow. I like it. I wish more orange would have showed up, but I'm happy that some of it did. I like how the green, I'm trying not to point, even though I like how the green has come out over here. Not so much on this side. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with this. So we'll see how it dries and I will put a picture at the end of this video. Go ahead and lift this up. If I can. Here's 
a close up. So tell me what you think. Appreciate your comments. It really helps me out, the algorithm of YouTube. The more comments, the more likes, the more people see it, which means the more people subscribe. So I really hope you subscribe. I know about probably 70% of you watching aren't subscribers. So push that subscribe button.